Okay. Okay. So over here, you can uh, set in your appointments. So I'm just going to open up the 9 a.m. slot right over here. Okay. Let's go ahead and add in your uh, patient name. I'm just going to add uh, just one letter names. Okay. Okay. Any comments that you have, you can just go ahead and add that in there. I'm not going to add anything in there. Okay. So for this model itself, I have a tooth number four. So I'm just going to go ahead and choose my tooth number here. Under job description, right down here, I'm going to choose a type of work I would like to do. So in this case, I'll just say that I want a zirconia crown. So I'm just going to go ahead and choose that. Color, you go ahead and choose your shade over here. So I'm just going to say like an A1 shade. Okay. And what's nice as well too, if you have like a, a two color crown, you can just go ahead and open up a color tool right here. I'm going to hit this draw button. Okay. Insert color name. Say I want like an A1 in sizal and an A2 gingival. Go ahead and add it in just as is. Okay. <clears throat> then after that, I can start my scanning process, or I can just save the appointment. In this case over here, I'm just going to go ahead and scan it in. That was my lower arch right over here. And I can always go back and fill in these small areas right over here. Right. I'm just going to go ahead and do my upper arch. Now what's nice about this is too, it actually has something called a swivel tip. So I can actually pull this tip off all right, and rotate it. So if I'm, if I'm scanning the maxillary arch, it's a lot easier. All right, I don't have to maneuver this around. And just go ahead and scan it as is. But in this case, I'm just going to go ahead and leave it as is, just like this. And over here I get to mark my preparation. Alright. So I'm just gonna say that's my number four. Okay. Now what I'm gonna do now I'm just gonna go ahead and open up a bite scan.
automatically it aligns your bite. Mm -hmm. So now you send the file to the lab, they, uh, they work with the model, yep, find, exactly. find the mar margin and then uh, printing the model. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. They find the margin on there, what they do is uh, it goes to a program called Model Builder and that comes with a three shape as long as you have uh, the impression module on there. And what you do on there, you create a base and you basically create an articulated model on there too. Right. So over here, this is my full model. And what's nice about this, you can actually check your bite on here. Unlike conventional, uh, was it impressions, hard for them to check if the bite is actually correct. Over here, they can check that. Right. So again, yeah, you just take this file, you hit this, this send button right over here, and it gets sent to the lab automatically. Okay. Thank mm -hmm. you, Josh, for yeah, the presentation. No of course.